I play Victor Richardson, who is best friend to Edward Britton, who is Vera's brother, who I then inadvertently am um, friends with Vera. Uh, Victor would very much like things to be more than friends with, with Vera. He's very much drawn to her. Vera is the through line of the story, and as, as, as people fall away around her, she's still that train that, that train that's just going straight ahead every time and that's an absolute you know testament to her <laughs> mrs layton who's roland's uh, mother used to call the three guys the three musketeers so there's a the feeling of of this little band of of brothers together and and that's that's very much where we find victor at the beginning it's part of that team on the cusp of life at that time there was a pressure and there was a conditioning and there was a breeding amongst those boys to be a part of that scene, in a way, to be a part of that heroics. Um, certainly in the, in the Uppingham School, the boys' public school, they were conditioned for heroics and to serve your country and to be part of that. I don't feel that Victor was ever fully part of that. I feel that he felt that he should be. And I think it's hard for people of our generation now to connect with that and to understand what it is to put so much trust into something like serving your country, something which you from a young age were conditioned to believe was, was so comforting and something that you could absolutely believe in could betray you so badly. There's a real sense of duty. I think there's a real sense of honour and pride, I think, whenever you're representing someone's life, because there's no way they could have ever thought something like this was going to happen, so there's a sense that you then have to do them proud. James is a very passionate director, he's a very sensitive director. I think he's got a real love for for this story and this project and a drive for it, and you can you see that immediately. It's an emotional roller coaster to go through, and it's a very tough schedule for Alessia. She is in every single scene. I think there's maybe two scenes where she's not in, and they're maybe like two seconds long. <laughs> but she's in. She's in every day, and she's she's absolutely taking it on on board the way Vera probably would. I think to have seen these young hobby boys marching off to war come back incomplete is really harrowing and it's really heartbreaking as well it just didn't occur to them that that would that would happen and the film does pull no punches in that way i think it's a film that that touches on on every generation i think any gender and i think any age for me, it's been an eye-opener, not knowing much about um, that period. Again, it can feel a bit, can feel a bit um, lost to us. I think it's important to keep that, that alive, that these are people that we can all be inspired by. I don't think we realise how easy we have it. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys! Hey You Guys, huh? Hey you guys, Is that yeah. from The Goonies? Yeah, it is indeed, yeah. Nice. Hey! hey.